Hey guys, I'm Brittany Hughes. You're watching MRC TV, and this is your reality check. An undergrad researcher at the University of Wisconsin Madison has decided that black people are dumber than a sack of rocks and just can't learn English. This social justice warrior, who's white, by the way, says that requiring black students to speak properly is oppressive and discriminatory, and that teachers should start allowing blacks to speak in Ebonics to avoid hurting their feelings. So now I have a question. How big of a hood-wearing, backwards-thinking, racist bigot do you have to be to assume that black people are so stupid that they can't learn proper English? Now, this country has already been down this road. They were called Jim Crow laws, and they were based on the lie that black people were inferior subhumans who were too stupid to do things like vote, attend public school, or run for local office. Now, today, this same bigotry fuels the myth that black students can't get into good colleges on their own, so they need a government-funded leg up or that black people can't manage to avoid committing crimes, so, you know, we should just change our entire criminal justice system instead. Or that black people can't be held responsible for their own sex lives, so we have to open up a Planned Parenthood on every corner and abort all the babies that they're clearly too weak to care for. I would like to point out that we have now had a black president serve not one, but two terms in office. We've had black secretaries of state, attorneys general, secretaries of homeland security, Grammy award-winning pop icons and Academy award-winning actors, superstar athletes and fashion designers, black CEOs, surgeons, philosophers, and rocket scientists, and the list goes on and on and on. Black Americans are just as smart and just as capable as anybody else in this country of taking responsibility for themselves, and they don't require some special accommodation by social justice warriors to succeed in their lives. See, that's the real racism in this country. Racism is not requiring people of color to take responsibility for themselves just like everyone else. Real racism is assuming that they can't. And that's your reality check, America. Make sure that you subscribe to YouTube for more videos just like this one. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and stay sane out there.